Okay, Cora, don't worry. You can come and stand by us if you like. Okay, thanks, Sky. See, Cora, there's nothing to worry about. Uh, oh. oh my gosh, ghosts! Oh dear. Blackjack, are you okay? No, I'm not. I can't get comfy anywhere. Uh, is there anything we can do to help, love? Like bring you some hay or something? No, there's nothing you can do. I'm going back inside. Poor Blackjack. I wonder when she is going to have her fall. I bet it's soon. She's passed her due date by a couple of days now. Well, I certainly hope so. <laughs> well, that doesn't sound good. How is she? Very agitated and moody. She might actually be having her fall then. Should we wake up the people? Yes, I think it would be worth it. All right then, I'm on it. Psst! Muddle! Muddle, are you there? Can you hear me? Yes, coming. Oh, hello there. Have I seen you before? Come on, Muddle, it's me. You seriously don't remember? Oh, Brandy, now I remember. We spoke the other night, didn't we? Yes, that's right. Now I need your help again to wake up the people in that room. Uh, what room? The one upstairs, just to your left. Oh, that room. I'm sorry, I get confused very easily. It's okay, don't worry. It's just very important because we think Blackjack's going to have her foal. No, oh, that's lovely. I do love moles. No, 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 no. Not mole, foal. I'm sorry, I don't hear the difference. Okay, don't worry then. Can you just wake up the people? Yes, I will do that. Phew, thank you. I still don't see what this has to do with moles. Never mind, I guess it's important. Wakey, wakey, strange furless creatures. Apparently there's something happening, but I seem to have forgotten. I think it was about holes? Oh, Muddle, go back to sleep, girl. Wait, what if she's trying to tell us something? Yeah, Black Jack might be having her fall. Come on, quick, let's go check. <gasps> that sounded like her. I'll call the vet. Okay, I'm getting the medical kit. Bella, are you even awake right now? Oh, so tired. Come on, we need you. Let's go. Okay, coming. <gasps> you. Oh, gosh, hi there. Oh, I am so going to get you. Come here. Ah! Don't worry, honey, everything is going to be absolutely fine. I can even hear the people moving around upstairs. Yes, it's okay. I'm going to be here for you the entire... Oops. Blaze, you dropped a hay bale on top of her? That is not helping. I'm sorry, okay? I'm just not good with these high-pressure situations. Could you all just be a bit more quiet, please? I'm trying to sleep here. Don't you start, Pocahontas. I will come over there. Um, excuse me, could you either help me or be quiet? This is going to be hard as it is without you three jabbering on and random things falling from the sky. Ah! What on earth was that? Um, that was a cat falling from the sky. Ouch. Um, I thought cats always landed on their feet. Um, apparently not. She doesn't look so good. No, she doesn't. Can we get a little ice over here, please? Um, that doesn't sound too good. Should someone go help? Are you kidding me? Have you seen how hard that mare can kick? Mm, you make a fair point. That's my sister in there. I should help her. To be honest, Outlaw, if you went in there, you'd probably lose your front teeth. Well, we can't just stand here. Hang on a second. I'm hearing something approaching fast. Ah, oh, perfect. It's the vet. The other people must have called her. You know, I think this is actually the first time I'm pleased to see the vet. Don't worry, everyone. I'm here. Terry, 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 have they opened up the door yet? Ronnie, you know how I said I'd let you know if something was happening? Well, I haven't let you know because nothing has happened. Ugh, I'm just excited to see the foal, that's all. I know, me too. Apparently, it's got a rainbow mane. Well, shut the front door, you're kidding! Nope, actual fact. Dude, how come I don't have a rainbow mane? Well, buddy, maybe you're just not that kind of cow. Darn it, I... Are you saying I'm not special, Terry? Oh, jeez, Ronnie, that's not what I meant. Because... <laughs> You know, maybe that's just true. Maybe I'm just average. Oh, no, not the waterworks. Ronnie, you are not average. You are the least average bull I've ever met. I mean, just look at your horns. They're magnificent. <laughs> you really mean it? Yes, of course I do. Thanks, pal. I almost doubted myself then. I mean, how ridiculous is that when I look this good? 
Ugh, here we go again. Are you nervous to meet your nephew, Ozzy? Um, no. Why? Why would I be nervous? Oh, you know, because the foal might not like you, that's all. That's all? I hadn't even thought of that. What if he doesn't like me? Now I'm panicking. <gasps> breathe, breathe. <sighs> now don't listen to Foxtrot. Hey! I'm sorry, but the foal's gonna love Ozzy. No, he's not. He's just gonna think I'm boring. <laughs> Seriously, why did you have to go and say that? Uh, when are the people opening up the door? I want to see my foal. Chill, dude. Don't worry. I'm sure it'll be any minute. I know. I just can't wait to see my little boy. That's all. <gasps> I should become the very first bull model. Ronnie, sorry to interrupt your promising career plans, but they're opening up the door. Hi there. <gasps> Oh my goodness! Terry, I can't see anything. All the horses are blocking it. You've got the longer neck. What can you see? Oh my goodness. That is the most adorable fluffy thing I have ever seen. I can't see it. Terry, I'm gonna have to get on your shoulders. Whoa, dude. Don't you dare. Do you want me to turn into an alpaca pancake? I thought you were a llama, right? Oh uh, yeah, a llama. That's what I meant. <laughs> What even is the difference between an alpaca and a llama? Rani, seriously, that is so offensive. I, I just, I don't even know what to say to you. You don't know either, do you? I have literally no idea. Hi there, oh my goodness, you are just the most precious thing I have ever seen. He is, isn't he? Sweetie, this is your dad. Uh... Oh, that was brutal. Poor Hunter. I'm just going to stay over here for a while. Come on, darling, it's okay. Okay. Yes, that's it. Well done. You two look so similar. Really? Ow. Oh, did he bite you? He does that. Oh, no. I just got my head stuck in the fence. So worth it, though. Have you had any ideas for a name? Um, actually, yes. I was thinking Boots, because look at his little legs. Yes, yes, yes. I love it. Oh, that is such a sweet name. Oh, yes, that went brilliantly. Everyone loves him. To be honest, I don't know how they couldn't. He's just so darn cute. Oh, he is, and he's just got the most adorable personality. It is brilliantly how he's doing so well. You girls will have to keep an eye on him, though, for the rest of the afternoon, because it is his first time in the paddock. Oh, yeah, we'll definitely keep an eye on him. Oh, great. There shouldn't be any problems, though, because we've taken all of the slightly grumpier horses out of the paddock. <clears throat> like Glimmer. <laughs> yeah, I sorted her out this morning. It was not a particularly pleasant experience. Come on, Glimmer. No. Please? No. Oh my goodness, come on. I refuse to move. Oh jeez, why does she have to make such a production out of everything? I don't know, it's mildly entertaining though. Yeah, true. Uh, why do you have to be so stubborn every single time? I can imagine. Yeah, just to be on the safe side, you might want to dot a couple of hay bales around the paddock to distract the other horses. Oh, that's a really good idea. We'll do that now. All right, awesome. I'll see you guys later. Hey, Boots, what's your favourite type of food? Do you like sugar cubes? Um... Do you like mounted games? They are awesome. Well, you can't forget about cross country. A nice gentle hack's lovely, though. Guys, we all know barrel racing's the best. Here you go, horses. And here's another one. Oh my gosh, hay bales. Oh, perfect. Why don't we go and have a snack? Sounds good to me. Well, coming through. Out of my way. Mmm, good hay. Um, hi sis. I, um, just wanted to introduce myself really quickly to Boots. Oh yeah, Ozzy, of course. I've been wondering where you were. Um, hi there, little buddy. I'm your uncle. Whoa, that's so cool. You really think so? Yeah, are you kidding? <laughs> I'm a cool uncle. Oh my gosh, I'm so pleased. Okay, I'll let you two have some time together. I'm just gonna go and uh, check out the hay bales. I'll see you guys later. Oh, I'm so proud of you, Boots. Boy, you're doing so well. Would you like to go and introduce yourself to the other foals while I have some hay? Yeah, I'd love to. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. I'm just gonna be over here. All right, here goes. Um, hello there. I'm Boots. Oh, hi there, tiny dude. I'm Rebel, the leader of the foals, and I'm actually a yearling. Whoa, no way. I know, it's pretty cool. Anyway, let me introduce you to the rest of my crew. This other little grey kilt here is Olaf, and he was born at Christmas time. And my other fellow filly here is Star, and she was born in the autumn. You were born in the autumn, right? Yes, that's right. So would you like to join our group, little guy? Yeah, count me in. Awesome, you're just in time because we're about to go on a top secret mission. No way. Uh-huh, it's just one of the regular awesome things that we do here. <gasps> What's the mission? You've got to promise not to tell anyone. Oh, uh, okay. Alright, cool. So, the aim of our mission is to find, wait for it, 
the Easter Bunny. We've got a plan all figured out. We were about to leave. Oh my goodness, that is so exciting. Do your parents know? <laughs> no, it's fine though. We've done this sort of thing before and we'll be back before they even realise we're gone. Okay, let's go find the Easter Bunny. That's the spirit power now. Let's get going. How are we even supposed to get out though? Over here, we've got a team that gets us out regularly. Oh my goodness, Terry, look who it is! Dude, I'm right here. Is that the little foley woly I see? Oh my goodness, hello there. Hey Terry, why doesn't it have a multicoloured mane? Hmm, that is strange. Sorry to interrupt you two, but we need to get out of here quickly. In that case, you're going to need a diversion, and I know just the bird for the job. Oh no, you're not seriously suggesting Darcy, are you? Who's Darcy? <gasps> She'll hear you. I've heard that she can turn her enemies to stone with her stare. She's the scariest animal I have ever met. Yeah, 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 whatever. Can she help us? Uh, you'll have to ask her. Okay, fine, if I have to do everything myself. <clears throat> Hello there, Darcy. I was wondering if you could give us a hand. <sniffs> ah, Terry, I can't watch. Me neither. Look, all we need you to do is go over to the other side of the paddock and cause a distraction. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's a mean swan. Look, lady, I don't know who you think you are hissing at me like that, but I've done nothing wrong. Oh my gosh, she did not just say that right, Terry. Tell me she didn't say that, Terry. Oh no, she said it all right. Oh no, poor rebel. Why, you lit- Oh, and by the way, if you help us, we'll bring you back a giant chocolate egg. Well, why didn't you say so, you silly filly? Chocolate is the only thing that I adore. Of course I'll help, as long as you bring me back that egg, which you will because you don't want me as your enemy. No, of course we will. Now go. Don't rush me, child. One must move with grace. <laughs> I will see you back here later, don't forget. Rebel, that was insane! You were so awesome! I seriously thought you were going to turn into swan food. Thanks, you guys, but we haven't actually gotten out of the paddock yet. We need to be ready for Darcy's distraction. Okay, okay, I'm getting into position. Come on, Olaf. Okay, I can see Darcy. She is moving into position. Hang on, everyone. Oh, a lot of the horses are looking up. Oh my goodness, is that Vallegro, the world-famous dressage horse? Oh my gosh, where? That guy is my idol. I want his hoof print. Okay, now. Go, go, go. Uh, uh. Okay, go. Slip under. <laughs> Coming through. Thanks, Ronnie. Here, <laughs> let's go. Putting it down. Come on, Foles, follow me. <laughs> see you later. Nice lifting, dude. Whoop. Wait, don't you guys want to come with us? Oh, we're sorry, little boots. We'd love to, but we can't jump the fence like you horses can. Terry, are you saying I'm not athletic? Oh, no, I just thought that maybe a guy of your size, while being oh, so no. strong... I'll see you guys um, later. ...might not be as, um, agile? No, I, I, I can prove to you that I can get over this fence. Oh, no, I don't think that's such a good idea. Do you remember last time you tried that? Watch this, Terry! Ow. Oh my gosh, dude, that was a total wipeout. Oh yeah, now that was embarrassing. Come on, let's go! What is this place, you guys? Oh, this is Silver Pine Forest. Well, technically the edge of the forest. You can see how it gets the name. All of the trees are very silvery. Oh, cool. It's so magical here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We need to get deeper into the forest because the Easter Bunny's not going to be near the edge. I completely agree. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> race you there. Boots? Ah! <laughs> Woohoo! Ah! Um, guys, does anyone actually know where we're going? Um, To be honest, no. I just thought it would become obvious once we were in the woods. So you're telling me we've been running around, not knowing where we're going, probably getting lost? Yeah, pretty much. Oh my gosh, we're going to be probably eaten by wild horses or something. Chill out, dude. We'll think of something. <laughs> Can you smell that? It's something very, very sweet. Oh yeah! Do you reckon it's sugar cubes? It must be. Nothing else is that sugary. I vote we follow the smell. Alrighty, sounds like a plan. Let's go. Let's find those Easter eggs. Whoa, guys, that didn't take very long. Oh my goodness, they're so colourful. I call the white one. I wonder where the Easter bunny is. Let's go and have a look. Be careful not to break them, though. Oh, that would be bad. Oh, they're so cute. Thank you. What? They speak? Oh, love, what are you doing? Dude, you're worrying me. Eggs can't talk. No, 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 no. I swear they did. I think I heard it too, buddy. Guys, that is physically impossible. They don't even have mouths. No, no, no. They can talk. Say something. Oi, watch where you're putting those hooves. Don't you know who I am? Oh, jeez, that's actually a talking egg. They must be cursed. Run, guys. No, no, wait, young horses. Look again. I'm not coming over there again. That's just what the eggs want us to do. Hang on, guys. Dude, if you get cursed by some talking egg, your mum's gonna kill me. No, guys, look at the middle one. 
Oh my goodness. It's a baby bunny. Oh my gosh, are you the Easter bunny? We're so sorry. That's quite all right, young foals. And yes, I am the Easter bunny. Um, no offence, but you're much smaller than I thought you'd be. None taken. I love being small. I can hide in lots of places others can't. By the way, the pretending to be an Easter egg trick? That is awesome. Thanks, it's one of my secret sneaky moves. One of them? What else can you do? Well, I can't tell you that, otherwise they wouldn't be a secret. Oh, carrots. What I can do, if you like, though, is give you some of these Easter eggs. Oh, now we're talking. Oh, and if it wouldn't be too much trouble, could we bring some back for our other friends? Yes, of course. It's Easter after all. Oh, wow, thanks. Oh, and there's one more thing I think you need. Oh, what's that? A way home. Oh, that would be very helpful. <laughs> Are you falls ready? Um, for what? Whoa, what just happened? Um, bunny teleportation? <laughs> hey, Darcy, we're back with your egg. Here it is. Hey, well, thank you. It looks splendid. Hey, Foley's, you're back. We missed you guys. Did you get any chocolate for us? Yes, of course. Here you go. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Come on over. We'll help you back into the paddock. Boots, sweetie, is that you? Quick, hide the eggs under the tree. Yes, Mum, coming. Incoming hug. Oh, I missed you too. Did you make new friends? Uh -huh, there's Rebel, Olaf and Star. Oh, I'm so pleased. They all seem really nice. <laughs> they are. waiting for i'm trying mine <coughs> oh gosh chocolate's disgusting all of that for something i can't even eat hmm i guess horses aren't supposed to eat chocolate eggs how are you actually supposed to eat this ronnie i can't get my lips around it um i'm having some slight technical difficulties too i seem to have speared it with my horn and now it's stuck <laughs> oh my gosh ronnie